देखो मैं जानता हूँ मुझे लेट हो गया है बहुत दिनों से मैंने बहुत गेम नहीं खेला है मैं वेलोरेंट पे ज़्यादा फोकस करता था लेकिन वन सेकेंड गाइज वी आर बैक अगेन विद अनदर गेम और ये इस गेम का नाम है मेट्रो एक्सोडस ये मेट्रो सीरीज़ का थर्ड पार्ट है और पिछले दो पार्ट्स भी मैं खेलूँगा क्योंकि पहले इसको खेल रहा हूँ क्योंकि ये लेटेस्ट निकला था और इस गेम को मुझे ट्राई भी करना था कभी नहीं खेला है और ऊपर से अगर आप सोच रहे कि ये पहला पार्ट है तो नहीं पहला पार्ट मैंने लाइव किया था शायद एक घंटे का वो उसका लिंक मैं डिस्क्रिप्शन में दे दूंगा आप जाके चेक कर लेना तो चलिए सेकंड पार्ट को शुरू करते हैं बिना किसी देरी के लेट्स को और हाँ अगर मैं गलती से चिल्ला है तो पहले बोल देता हूँ इस गेम में जम्प स्केयर से Okay. And there's definitely a lot of those up ahead. I don't need a lot, really. It's quality that matters. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they while we were eating each other alive in the metro? We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau, if we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control according to Miller and we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed? That we'll get some answers. Ekte Anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! On a trolley. All hands, report to the bridge on the double. हाँ हाँ मुझे ही जाना पड़ेगा Are you alright, Artyom? How bad is it? Can we move? No, we're stuck. Oh shit. Damn fog. Seems we ran through someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could have put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we hey. can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. 
Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that breach. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with Artyom too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you're not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak! When can you get the Aurora running again? We to find out who lives here, who shot at us, and what's behind the bridge. As usual, I'm going together with Anna. I will have to watch out for her too. Get to it then! Spartans, let's prepare the Aurora for a defensive action! Let's go, Artyom! Get the perimeter! I'm on yes, it. sir! Duke, I need you to recon the immediate area! Got that, sir! Idiot! You give me okay. over from Don't the old your backpack. Yes, it's a new model. A portable workshop, yes, so to speak. The manual is inside. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. Well, I gotta all. say, that Good was one work, flimsy guys. roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies by conviction or out of fear. Got it? Is there anything here? Ah, that was great. Artyom, don't wander off. What would you do if some beast came and ate your wife? Where are you? Okay. What was that? Could you check it out? I took a look around while you're inside. That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go. Look, a rabbit! It doesn't look like a rabbit to me, but... Okay. probably get around mainly by boat. Let me search this place first because need many things.
Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. I'll call you when I'm settled. Right away. Can we just move? So please keep the weapons shield and I am coming, just wait. won't even talk to heretics but i'll tell you everything i've seen Artyom, in this place all that year under the cover of fog. oh it's the bridge guard silentia has fooled them just like the locals but unlike them the bridge guard have guns run there's a way out down here and there's a boat at the dock we also have one but it's too small for all of us Artyom, she's right get to the boat we will rescue her later don't worry okay Go. लगता है गन नीचे गिर गया
I know you can handle this just fine. Ah, uh, hey, 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 son la bajita. I'm going, I don't know. Just don't shoot. I give up. Don't, don't you see? He doesn't look like a bandit. So even if he kills me, I want to torture. I have to get out. Wait, wait, wait. I think I'm lost. This is the way. Wait, let me, let me check on map. Outside the church, wait. Take the big gun in my hand. I don't have a lot of money. I can't do anything in this game. Are you alright? A shame you couldn't get away quietly. Without bloodshed. They're bound to hate us even more now. Oh well. Artyom, Katya, and Nastya are with me now. See you aboard the Aurora. Check the map. Looks like you can row straight to it from there. Hey, hey. Maka. Mark. 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 Thank <laughs> you. 
What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge! The old man sent me out as a forward sentry, told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a front row seat watching you there. And so you subdue the occupation forces peacefully with a holy cross and a prayer. <laughs> Anna has already reported on the cult. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? But I, I have to know. say it's unfair. I've been dragged out of Moscow and for what? Stalking the furnace and sitting in a bog with a dumb spyglass. Here though, we do have a chance of finding some loot. There is this plane there. Just leave something for me. I'll have to stay longer, I suspect. Yeah. The shrimps are giving me trouble though. So find something here. Let's just run. Just run. Ignore them. Fully ignore them. Artyom, back from the abyss of Nail. You're alive. <laughs> Thank you for the information, Katya. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course. What do you know of the occupation forces? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't quite get what you... So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? 
No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Hmm. Artem, a moment. Artem, stop by my desk once you're done talking to the old man. I've got something for you. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we're to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yaramak can't handle the repairs alone. So once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. Then get back ASAP. We'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Okay. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably get us in the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source, the Moscow government is essentially a local council, to put things in perspective. So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge. Thank you, Artyom. If not for you, we'd never have escaped that place. They were so busy looking for you. And then Anna picked us up. Yes, Uncle Artyom. Thank you. And your wife is great. She's kind and really strong. Thank you, Auntie Anna. There you go, Artyom. As I always said, you lucked out with me. Mm. We all lucked out with Anna. She's a total dead eye. How do you like the backpack? Is it comfortable? Can you operate stealthily with it? How do you use the backpack? I don't know. <laughs> I have a present for you here. A Tihar rifle. Ring any bells? It's pneumatic, but it still packs a wallop. Plus, making bullets for it is easy as pie, even in the field. Just remember to keep that pressure up. Otherwise, you might as well be spitting him out yourself. Other than that, it will never fail you. I did my best. So, that is with honor. <laughs> and don't forget to drop by from time to time. I have a few ideas for the Katya, Nastya, come have some tea. Don't be shy. Thank you. Wait, how to open backpack? I have to see. Old eye, okay. So, Katia, where are you uh, from? The southern Ural. A couple of years ago, we heard there was this great place on the Volga, so we made the journey. Who can have known that fanatics were in control now? And they say this place used to be great. Did you come with your husband? There were 15 of us, but now only Nastya and I are alive. I, I'm sorry. Hey, why are you so gloomy? Don't you like the tea? I do. Oh, when the gargoyle attacked, Nastya lost her teddy. The beast carried it away. Oh, must have thought it was alive. Oh, don't you worry. We'll find your teddy. Oh. We call them demons in Moscow. And you call them gargoyles. Yes. Where did those things crawl out from, I wonder? Artyom, uh, I took some measurements. There is one hell of a radioactive hotspot between this place and the port. The regions are off the scale. So you better take a boat. We found one and docked it under the bridge. 
Well, unless you're well, afraid of the monster. Maybe Duke told us over the radio. Artyom, are you going to the port? I'm going to relieve Alyosha now, so I can't come with you. His hand is still giving him trouble. So Katya being a nurse is just perfect. It will make convincing dad to take Okay, I have to go along. Let's do this. No wonder Silas has such a hold over everyone here, with people seeing things like that every day.